Welcome to Shelburne Park for one of the most eagerly anticipated nights racing of the year. Tonight we're going to watch the future champions in action in the semi-finals of the Comerford Cakes National Puppy Stake. In the opening heat, the big two in the market were two Ballymac Tip and six Fat Boys Tyson. Much was going to depend on the start. And away they go, a very slow start by four. He haws a Razi, it's two Bally Tip, five Kevin Starr on the outside, six Fat Boys Tyson, the three market principles. It's two Bally Tip now, leads him into the far side, but six Fat Boys Tyson challenging the outside, two Bally Tip moving wide, and six Fat Boys Tyson forced even wider, five on the inside. There, Kevin Starr, one forced to check Bally rebound, but it's two Bally Tip who's going to lead them into the home straight, six Fat Boys Tyson coming back for more, but two Bally Tip does enough. Second is six Fat Boys Tyson. Third was one Bally Mac rebound. The winning time, 28.55. Delighted with it. We were hoping we'd qualify and we felt we might win the heat, but you need a look no matter how good things are, you still need a look with it. And he got the run on the race and everything went to plan. Well, he didn't come away real well, but his early pace got him to the bend and they were queuing up the pass and going into the third bend, but he's a game little bit. He's only 65 pound weight, but he is all hard. And he just kept battling out and he held on and won by a length. You know? So we're delighted with that, you know. In terms of pure quality, this second semi-final was as good as any final of any national puppy stake in the past 15 years. The likes of Colourful Champion 2, Tully Murray Acton 3 and 6 November Weather were expected a challenge for Classic Honours in 2010. And away they go in a good start by Trap 3. That's Tully Murray Act, two colourful champ on the inside. Into the bend, it is three. Tully Murray Act, who leads round now in second spot. We have Trap 5, Bay Point Dave. Then comes four, Fat Boys Georgie. But down the far side in three, Tully Murray Act is four, five lengths clear of five, Bay Point Dave. Then comes four, Fat Boys Georgie. But out front and still Trap 3, Tully Murray Act sets a blistering gallop. Five, Bay Point Dave in second. Back in third is four, Fat Boys Georgie. But up to the line is three, Tully Murray Act, who wins in style. Second is five, Bay Point Dave. And third was four, Fat Boys Georgie. The winning time, 28-40. Well, he come out of the traps this week, not like last week. He come out, got a clean run to the bend, took it up and just ran away from him, to be quite honest. What we expect him to do when he gets a clean run, he's a very, very fast dog. I'm very pleased with him. We've got the draw next week, trap three. We're very happy, confident. The trap draw for the Comerford Cakes National Puppy Stake Final was made following the second semi. It has resulted as follows. One, Bally Mac rebound. In two, Bally Mac tip. Three, Tully Murray act. In four, Fat Boys Georgie. Five, Fate Point Dave. And six, Fat Boys Tyson. Remarkably, all six finalists in the same trap they held in the semi-final. The likely favourite trap three, Tully Murray Act, although he's going to have to get around Bally Mac Tip if he's going to land yet another big one for Pat Buckley. It promised to be an intriguing final.